Susan and Brian, it's been true for as long as I've been covering these events that reaction to the speech is very much along party lines. But today in talking to a Senate Majority Leader, a Republican from Ottawa County, and a Democratic representative from Kent County, there may be some areas where the governor and legislature can work together. Last night's speech was received differently, depending on which side of the chamber that you occupied, to be sure. But Grand Rapids Representative David Legrand, a first-term Democrat, said he heard some things that he liked. While term-limited Senator Arlen Meekoff, a Republican from Ottawa County, as we pointed out, says he'll work with the governor where he can. I liked his emphasis on civility because I think that that's a big problem in America right now. Um, I think that if we stop talking to each other, we're going to stop having a republic. And I think that that's a very dangerous issue. I think the other real issue in America right now that we've got to be concerned about is the growing gap between the rich and the poor. And um, I think that Often in Grand Rapids, you can tell a tale of two cities. Some of those things we will agree with the governor, probably many of them. I don't think all of them. It's just like any family. You don't sit around the kitchen table and everybody agree on every single thing. But as is in the past, we'll find a way to make the budget work, funding our priorities, and it'll be on time, no smoking, and because the public depends on it. Both men have their own priorities, too, of course, and you can see and hear the entire interviews this Sunday morning at 10 o'clock on Wood TV 8 for To the Point.